Umar Ahmed, IFL TV, MTK Global. I'm at your call for the MTK show. I'm with Charlie Edwards, just seen his brother put an emphatic display on against Ryan Frag. Yeah, your reaction to that fight, please. Listen, he showed why we call him Sunny Showtime. He showed it like he's a class act, a world class fighter, and when he gets these when he gets these fights and and he shows everyone what, how good he is and to, to get put on TV for the first time, people will be talking about him now. He's made the name for himself and listen, he's gonna be gunning for everyone in the division. I better pack my bag and move on. <laughs> I better go up to Bantamweight soon. <laughs> yeah, you mentioned live on Box Nation there, that's great for him. Yeah. Um, but yeah, just in terms of the actual performance, shut out display. It was a it was a boxing lesson. Uh, there's no two ways about it. An absolute boxing lesson. He really dissected him. He showed he doesn't just run. He pushed him back. He hurt him at times as well. And he really did show his class. It was quite a heated I'm build up. A proper proud brother moment right now. <laughs> proper it was, proud. It was quite a heated build up to say the least. Yeah. Um, after the fight, did you or his brother say anything to him? Listen, it's boxing in it. It is what it is. It is what it is. And um, yeah. He's, he's been humble now, and you can talk a good game for the fight. My brother's very good at winding people up. Like he can literally argue with it himself in a phone box if it comes down to it. So you won't get one past him. Don't worry, I've had years of trying to to beat him in arguments, and I just let it go over my head. So he knows how to get in people's heads. He's got that special aura about him. He's like a he's like a fury. He's like he can get in someone's head. He can wind them up and. It doesn't affect his performance. If anything, he thrives off it, and it, it helps him perform better. Diamonds, diamonds are made under pressure, and that's what we saw tonight. I think a lot of people who hadn't seen Sunny Box before live were really impressed and taken aback. I mean, it was a brilliant display. He's a special fighter. He's a world-level special fighter, and the harder the opponents come, the more he will do it. He's, he's a class act. Now. I've said, been saying it for years, for years and years and years. I've been saying it. everyone goes, who's a better rubber? Him. <laughs> More, most talent. Very honest. Most talent. I work hard and I put in everything, but talent-wise, he is. He can be an absolute great. He's got that old kind of Pernell Whitaker type of style, and it causes people mega problems. A few months back, Paddy Barnes lost to Rosales. Um, that is the fight that Sonny wants next, surely. He probably told you himself. That's the fight he wants. And to be honest, it makes sense now. The back of that performance, after Paddy just been beat off Rosales, he's saying he wants to fight a tough Mexican or something. Mm. Why not fight Sonny? Because it's a massive fight. And I know for a fact Sonny would go to Belfast. So it's, it's all in the book. Listen, it's MTK's job. If they're gonna make it, they're gonna make it. And it's just a matter of time. Anyways, moving on to the lesser brother, in your opinion, yeah, to you. Brother. What's happening with you, Charlie? Um, I'm fighting on the 22nd of December um, at the O2. Yeah. I'm not sure what bill it is yet. Well, Dylan White's going to fight, we know that, but we don't but know the opponent. It's looking like a big, big fight. So, just waiting Title on a few shot. dots and a few T's to be crossed, and, um, yeah. and yeah. then we can go, we can, we can release it. But I'm just waiting, sitting, sitting back on just waiting for the news to come in. Okay, listen, Charlie. Congratulations to Team Edwards tonight on an emphatic display, as I said, and uh, I'm sure we'll catch up soon before your fight on the 22nd. Anything you'd like to add on IFL? Just thank you for everyone who shows support for Sunny, all the fans that come out today, all our sponsors that allow us to train full time. Like, without them, it wouldn't be possible. So, yeah, thank you. All right, Charlie Edwards, thank you for your time, and we'll catch up soon. Top man.